sculpture is called Calyx, uh, which takes inspiration from annual plants that uh, produce flowers. For the past year, we have been working on optimizing the form of the sculpture as well as fabricating the necessary pieces. Seeing the thing being uh, unwrapped and installed and put together, you kind of see the whole thing for the first time and you see your uh, vision being realized. Public art's important because it, it, it's, it forms a kind of signature of our culture and our society. And I think um, having art on campus elevates uh, the experience of being here. The sculpture is approximately 12 feet tall and it's made out of 500 pieces and they're welded to each other. You want to try sliding it from the top? You need to be really precise and uh, that's when technology can come to our aid because it can produce the fine details of the pieces we need to acquire as well as help us um, put the pieces together. Look, it, it fits. Yeah, it's better. The sculpture actually takes inspiration from uh, leaf venation systems and I'm using uh, an algorithm to develop leaf venation patterns. I think it's a really fruitful process to embed technology in, into art. I think the site is ideal for this piece. It's here outside of Sage Art Center and it, it kind of marks a space for art production on campus, but it's also a kind of key crossroads. We're really confused really? as to why there's this giant concrete triangle yes. and we're like, what's going to be on it? The form itself is really simple. I want it to have a canopy that could be a gathering point for the students. Because of the location of the sculpture, it's actually at a junction point where the schools are connected to the dorms and I think it can, um, it can be an activator of the area. I'm hopeful that this is the start of an ongoing process where, where we, we lend some uniqueness to this campus and are identified through art and the humanities as much as we are through the sciences. has some significance to be placed on a university campus because in a person's development right now, the university education is an important stage. Calyx actually represents the source of achievement so that students can actually carry on their knowledge and skills and abilities and experience the, the next fruitful uh, stage in their life. It brings to question the intersections of art and science and it brings to question our daily experience. I think that this will challenge some people's aesthetics. This might challenge some people intellectually. That's art working at its best. A production of the University of Rochester. Please visit us online and subscribe to our channel for more videos.